With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So let's see this question. In this question it is given on adding 100 ml of 10 to the power minus 2 molar NaOH, the solution to 100 ml of 0, 0.0 m molar trithylamine solution KB is 6.4 into 10 to the power minus 5 change in pH of the solution will be. So let's see that before adding NaOH, what was the reaction? What was the pH, right? So it was trithylamine only before adding NaOH. So it is CH3 tris N plus H2O giving you CH3 whole tris N plus H and then you have here OH minus, right? Now it is said what is the concentration? 0 0.01 molar. So it is 0 0.01 molar. Now this will be 0, 0 at t is equal to 0 you can say and at t is equal to equilibrium it will be 0 0.01 minus x it will be x and it will be x. Now, now let's write down the equilibrium constant of the reaction. So it will be pro uh, con product of the concentration of the products. So CH3 whole thrice N plus H and that is multiplied with the concentration of the OH minus divided by the concentration of CH3 whole thrice n right so from here what you are going to say it will be x squared divided by 0 0.01 minus x right this will be the thing now we know that as x is expected to be very very less than you can say even 0 0.01 x will be it is expected that x is very very less than it is from Oswald so what we can say that 0 0.01 minus x is almost equals to 0 0.01 only so now you can say kb will be equals to x square divided by 0 0.01 so from here what you can say that uh, uh, this can be written as this can be written as kb into uh, 0 0.01 that is 10 to the power minus 2 that is equals to x square now what is kb kb is given 6.4 into 10 to the power minus 5 so finally you can say this that 6.4 into 10 to the power minus 5 and then this 10 to the power minus 2 so uh, minus 7 that is equals to x square so x square can be written as 64 into 10 to the power minus 8 x will come out to be 8 into 10 to the power minus 4 right x will come out to be 8 into 10 to the power minus 4 so from here what you can say the concentration of which minus was x so concentration of which minus will be 8 into 10 to the power minus 4 you know very well that POH is minus log of OH minus, minus log of OH minus. So what you can say it will be minus log of 8 into 10 to the power minus 4 which can be written as 4 minus log 8. So finally the value of POH will come out to be 4 minus log 8 which is uh, 3.097 approximately. So from here you can say pH will be 14 minus POH that can be written as 14 minus 3.097. 097 which will come out to be 10.903 so this is the initial pH now let's see after addition of NaOH what is happening so now the reaction uh, reaction again if I write trithylamine when it is reacted with water uh, it is giving you CH3 whole thrice NH plus plus OH minus now so now when uh, uh, NaOH is added the NaOH is 100 ml of 10 to the power minus 2 molar NaOH is added so let's see first of all what is the number of millimoles of NaOH added so number of millimoles of NaOH will be how much 10 to the power minus 2 10 to the power minus 2 that is we know that number of millimoles is given by the formula molarity into volume in milliliters so what is the molarity molarity is 10 to the power minus 2 into volume in milliliter is 100 ml so finally you will say 1 is the number of millimoles of NaOH added right so number of millimoles of NaOH means what OH minus concentration initially will be 1 millimole OH minus initially will be 1 millimole already it will be present in the solution this is only and we already know that number of millimoles of trithylamine number of millimoles number of millimoles of trithylamine will be amine is what it is also 10 to the power minus 2 into 100 ml that is equals to 1 molarity into volume so finally what you will say let's write down here that initially at t is equal to 0 the number of millimoles of csc voltage n was 1 and uh, this was 0 and OH minus was 1, right? Because of the NaOH added, initially OH minus is also 1. But at equilibrium, let's say it has decreased by X amount. So this will be X and this will be 1 plus X. It will increase further from 1. So it will be 1 plus X. Now, if you write down the equation of the 
equilibrium constraint so first of all these are what these are millimoles right these are millimoles so you need to find out the concentration so concentration can, how can concentration be written so you will write down concentration of ch3 whole thrice n will be equals to what number of millimoles divided by the total volume what is the total volume total volume of the solution will be 100 ml of NaOH and 100 ml of triethylamine so total volume will be 200 so the concentration of CSC whole thrice n is 200 similarly at equilibrium if you find out the concentration of CSC whole thrice NH plus CS3 whole thrice NH plus right so it will be it will it will come out to be x by 200 right and similarly the concentration of OH minus at equilibrium will be how much 1 plus x is number of millimoles divided by 200 because concentration is moles per liter or you can say the moles divided by the volume. So these are the concentrations. Now you will write down the expression for uh, constant equilibrium constant Kb. So it is again the uh, multiplication of the concentration of the products divided by the reactant. So what are the products? This is product OH minus and this is the product. So you will multiply their reactants x by 200 into 1 plus x by 200 these reactants are multiplied and then it is divided by the reactants of the uh, by the uh, concentration of the reactant so that is 1 minus x by 200 so finally this value can be written as this 200 and 200 will cancel out finally this value is x into 1 plus x divided by 200 into 1 minus x now what is uh, assumed here again what is assumed i will tell you because because x is considered to be very very less than 1 x is very very less than 1 then 1 minus x is almost considered as 1 and if you multiply the numerator the numerator will be x plus x square divided by 200 200 because 1 minus x we have already considered it to be almost equals to 1 since x is very very less than 1 now if you see here that x square x square will also be very small because power of x will be very small as x is neglect as as x is too small we know that powers of x will also be neglected because x is too small then definitely their power will also be much much smaller so finally what you will say that if x square is also neglected then finally you can say this that kb will be equals to kb will be equals to x by 200 so finally you can say x in this case will be equals to 200 into kb and what was uh, so 200 into kb is the value of x here 200 into kb so what you can say x will be equals to x will be equals to what 200 into what is kb so it will be 200 into 6.4 into 10 to the power minus 5 and finally from here x will come out to be what will be the value of x x will come out to be 1.28 into 10 to the power minus 2 right now we know the concentration of oh minus is how much 1 plus x by 200 right so it will be 1 plus 1.28 into 10 to the power minus 2 divided by 200 so from here the OH minus concentration will be the OH minus concentration will be 0 0.005064 so if you have find out the OH minus concentration then you can easily find out POH which is minus log of OH minus concentration so it is minus log of 0 0.005064 which will come out to be around 2.5 2.295 this will be the poh so if poh is this then ph can be written as 14 minus poh that is 14 minus 2.295 this value will be 11.704 so this is the ph final so what is the change in ph then the change in ph is ph final minus ph initial so ph final is 11.704 minus what is the initial ph initial pH was 10.903 so this will be minus 10.903 10.903 so this value this value will come out to be around 0 0.801 right this value will come out to be around 0 0.801 so let's check which option is correct you can see very well that the most nearest option is 0 plus 0 0.8 so we'll see that we'll write that option B is option B is correct, right? I hope you have understood. Thank you very much. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.